Welcome back to To Fishy Outdoors. Today we're back at Dunedin Causeway and maybe stay for two, three hours and see if anything's biting. High tide right now and the tide's gonna be moving out all afternoon. So a couple hours of feeding time. We'll see if anything's here. I don't know, there's a lot of spots open right now, which is kind of weird. Nobody's out. We'll see. We didn't bring any bait today, so throw some artificials today and uh, jigs. Got the cast net just in case we see any bait, but I don't know. Doesn't look good so far. So we'll see. We're gonna throw the white jig and then we got a banana jig and see if any of those things catch anything. Oh, oh, there's bait right there. Look at all that. What's all that? Look. Tiny little guys. Bunch of little tiny guys. Tiny bait. Mm, too small for the cast net. Oh, fish on. Fish on already. Fish on with the bow. Oh, yeah. Fish on. On the white jig. Oh, it's a little jack. Look at that. This is a little jack on the white jig famous white jig first cast <laughs> not bad at all oh man i got him in the eyeball got him in the eyeball may not make it first cast we had a uh, jack which isn't too bad without having any bait at all but now we're helping maybe there could be some spanish hanging around here today. Water's really high, it's high tide. And the uh, feeding time is coming up in about 15 minutes or so. It's gonna last a couple hours today, major feeding time. Without having any bait, it could be a little rough, but so far I caught one fish, not bad. And I'm surprised there's some spots open over here. Few people out fishing today. Yeah, I got another fish on. Got another fish on. Oh, what is that that time? What is that? Oh, it's another. Oh, it's a one of those uh, pinfish. Pinfish time. Another fish on. What is it that time? Oh, it's a pinfish caught on the belly. Pinfish caught on the belly. I have to keep this pinfish because we might need bait. Even though without any bait, we're still catching fish. Maybe not as many, but we're still catching fish. A little banana jig, also called what the goofy jig something like that this is one i found i think over here some time ago i don't know still looks okay it doesn't have the teaser i like them with the teasers on them but you can't beat the one that you find for free i'm gonna throw this for a little bit just to see maybe I might get lucky and catch something like a pompano or Something like that, never know. First cast! Boy, that goes far. Because it weighs a bunch. And we're gonna let that thing sink to the bottom. And we're just gonna jig it off the bottom. A manatee? I don't know what that is. Looks like, looks like a manatee swimming by. Hasn't come up though. There's a guy down there, just caught himself a nice Spanish. Nice huge Spanish, I don't know what he was using, but nice. Yeah, at least we know there's some Spanish in here. Charles and Laura's have made it here to the fishing spot.
the tide is moving out and it's bringing a bunch of grass. So it's not easy trying to cast and not catch grass right now. Charles catching grass. He's got the famous white jig. He's been practicing on that white jig a lot and catching fish too. But today it's gonna be hard due to that grass. Laura's over here chilling out. Had a fish on, lost it already. Stuff a nice pinfish. This guy over here is catching all the fish with a little pompano jig. Yep. Still got another hour of major feeding time. It's a ladyfish. Yep, ladyfish. Big ladyfish. All right, do we want the lady fish for anything? Oh, yeah, big sucker. All right, first big decent fish for the day right there is a lady fish. Okay, nice. Here we go. Look at that, that's a good sized lady. Out of here, buddy. So, that might be a good sign. Ladies in here. Let's see, Laura's got a fish now. Oh, look at that. That's a that's a good sized pinfish. Oh man. I'm just gonna cut him. Cut him? Make it into bait. I'm tired of Oh, okay. Nice pinfish. That's a pretty good size. Big pinfish right there, dudes. Out of here. Other jack. Look at that. Little jack. It's almost like a small jack, but that's a jack right there. Jacky jack. Something is there. I'm sure that Laura, you had a jack on that one because it was chasing after each other. So at least some biting going on. Look at that, got a little big. Oh, that's not a little guy, that's a big puffer. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at that. Giant puffer. Oh, look at him, he's going for it. Got some uh, damage from the prior catching or something. Yeah, prior damage. Boing! Oh, it's a pompano. Pompano. I think so. Nice pompano. Jeez. I don't know what on that is, but oh yeah. Yes, yeah, sir. That's a nice pump. That's a good size pump right there. It has to be what 12, 12 inches. Definitely 12 inch pump. That is unexpected for sure. That is like a 14, 13, 14 inch pump. That's pretty exciting. That one goes in the cooler. Wow. Oh, I almost bent my hook back. Sure did. All right. Another one. What is that? Go! What is that? Trout? Oh, it is a trout. That's the first trout that I've caught here in a long time. Don't even try to catch trout out here. That was a 14 incher. Well, the birds are definitely under the bridge trying to catch bait. So there's bait under the bridge. But. Nothing's biting under the bridge. I caught him, a little tiny squirrel fish. 
You caught him a squirrel fish? Yeah. And that one. Just now, got yourself a squirrely. Sand perch. Ah, Charles got him a little guy. This one is a little bit bigger than that, but it's not that big. Right here. Nope. All right, we're gonna wrap it up for today here at Dunedin Causeway. We got us a nice pompano, keeper pompano, which is not bad. Not bad day. And a trout, some couple jacks, and a bunch of pinfish. The battery's about dead on the GoPro, so we're gonna wrap it up. So until our next fishing adventure, hit that like button, comment, and subscribe.